All right, here's the morning duck routine. You start with one of the buckets and fill it up with duck food. About three scoops. And then you want to get a little bit of goat food to distract the goats and get Sarabi's breakfast ready. Okay, once you have all that ready, head in. Hopefully without letting the goats out. Come here, Sarabi! Got Sarabi's food in her new little den. The goats don't really need food, but this just distracts them and makes it easier for you to feed the ducks. Sarabi! Aslan! You can close this gate to keep the duck or the goats out. You don't really have to. Just the babies, it's pretty easy. Thank you, Sarabi. I know, those are nice kisses. And just come out here, kind of near the coop, dump the food on the ground, and then let the ducks come get it. Cheep, 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 cheep. So Robbie's eating the eggshells. It helps if you stand off to the side, otherwise the ducks get nervous to walk by you or the dogs. Cheep, 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 cheep. Cheep, 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 cheep. Cheep, 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 cheep. And eventually, after all the ducks get out, or most of them at least, you can go and collect the eggs. So, I'll show you some of their hiding spots in the big coop. Um, or the first coop over here. We usually have a couple. Sometimes under this bin, I don't see any today. Sometimes over here, but I don't see any today either. Um, looks like that's all in the big, the first coop. And then, and the next one, we like to lay in this tire. here in this little corner. And if you go past the divider, Usually out here. You can also see there's a little pile outside too. What they like. They also will occasionally just create new nests, which are sometimes hard to spot, but if you see anything that looks like it might be a nest or have feathers or straw or something in a little circle, it's worth checking and seeing if there's eggs under it. Okay, over here on this side, right behind the cinder block, up against the fence. And you 
I should be getting probably around 70 eggs a day, which is a lot. And then back in this corner, these they bury pretty good in the mulch, so I've got to dig for them. Just those two, yeah. Okay. These are the coop spots. And then they've had a nest right here but haven't used it the last few days. Also in this tire sometimes or right behind it. And just randomly under all this junk, you sometimes find eggs. This guy. This is a good hidden one here with this post against the coop. So the grapevine, and then there's almost always a couple eggs in here. They're not super easy to get to. Back to this corner. Oh, and I forgot, I usually fill up these pools while I'm doing the eggs. So, I'll come dump them, rinse them, start filling them, and then show you the rest of the egg spots. Okay. Um, So there's quite a few usually just around the pools. Those guys are pretty easy to spot, not too hidden. And then they've got a couple nests in these blueberry bushes. Those are also not usually too hidden. There's one here, there's one here, and then in the last corner, those sometimes get buried, um, but most of them should be pretty visible in the blueberries. And then in this garden area, this is a nest. Sometimes they bury them. There's one in this side. Here. Sometimes in between the containers on the ground. Up in this container there's a little nest. Those usually don't get buried too much, but just make sure you check all these boxes. And then down on the ground in here sometimes. And then two recent nests along here. They've been making a new nest. I don't see anything today, but some days there's an egg in there. And then occasionally up here, yeah, look, there's one in there. And then along this trash pile, there's random eggs usually. A couple more. Here's another nest. Almost always has eggs. There's one in there. And the last one that's hidden, um, oh yeah, sometimes around this bucket and pomegranate tree you'll find an egg or two. Um, but the last hidden nest is right by this water. They sometimes play in this little pile of leaves. I don't see any today. Maybe they gave up on that nest. All right, so that's my morning routine. Once I collect all the eggs, turn off the water, and then 
just close up the gates and head inside.